hello, Denton. This is Jake Laughlin bringing you another episode of Discover Denton, a show brought to you by the Denton Convention and Visitors Bureau, highlighting events around Denton. This week we have Kim Phillips talking about several different programs we've got going on in Denton that are very, very exciting. So strap in and let's hear Discover Denton. Hello, Denton, and welcome to Discover Denton Radio. I'm Kim Phillips coming to you today from the Denton Convention and Visitors Bureau. Thanks for being here. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about, well, leftover Valentine's Day. Last week was Valentine's Day, but I think love is still in the air just a little bit. And I want to talk to you about a campaign that we have going on right now called Engaged in Denton. Now I actually mentioned this to you just really briefly, didn't fill in a whole lot of blanks back at the first of the year when I told you about our goals for this coming year. Engaged in Denton is a campaign that is on our annual goals. It's something that will be going on all year long, but to launch it, we have a contest, and it is in motion right now, and that's why I wanted to take today to tell you a little bit about it. Engaged in Denton is a contest where it's it's actually on our website. You can go to discoverdenton.com and weddings. Just choose. It's right at the top on the top homepage uh, toolbar. You click it right there, and It is a contest where some lucky lady is going to win $2,500 towards her wedding. Now, that's a nice chunk of change towards the average wedding cost these days. We have people planning weddings in Denton from all kinds of walks of life, all kinds of dreams, all kinds of budgets. And it's because of that that weddings has become such a big business here. In fact, we have more than 10 wedding venues in Denton that I mean are rocking wedding after wedding after wedding. For instance, the Little Chapel at Texas Woman's University, probably the most famous for smaller weddings, that place can turn eight to ten weddings in a day. That's how much is going on here. But then when you think about it, we've got 50,000 young people of marrying age in college that are that are just a perfect demographic, not to mention the people that come back here and make Denton their home. So here's how it works. You go to our website, discoverdenton.com, and you look at the wedding venues. You choose a wedding venue that you think looks interesting, and you schedule a visit with that venue. And it has to be a realistic one. You can't just, like, walk in the door and and do this. You've got to literally sit down and have a meeting with at least one venue. While you're at the venue, you take a picture at the venue using a wedding prop. Now your wedding prop can be anything. It can be your engagement ring. It could be a bouquet. It could be you're wearing your veil. Like I've seen a lot of groups that'll do this when they're on their bachelorette party and the bachelorette is wearing her veil everywhere they go. It can even be that kind of a veil, a funny veil. Um, Some kind of a wedding prop. You take a picture of yourself at the venue, and it can be a selfie, or if, you're, if your maid of honor is hanging out with you um, for this, looking at the various venues, helping you make that decision, maid of honor can snap that photo, or maybe it's your mom, or, or maybe it's the attendant that's working at the venue. But you want that picture with a wedding prop, and then you post it either on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook, and tag it. Tag the picture using the hashtag engaged in Denton. That's it. You post your pictures there. And here's the deal. You can, if the more venues you will go to and visit, the more times you're entered in the, in the pot to win the $2,500. So how does the $2,500 actually happen? Well, it comes to you in services. We've got some awesome sponsors that are giving away their services to someone. And the only trick to this is you hold your wedding in Denton. Alpha Graphics is donating Save the Dates or Reservation Cards. Uh, Extreme Cuisine Catering is donating Karen Scruggs Photography. Holly's Garden and Florist. Denton Depot. Zira Coffee. Candy Haven. Best Wedding Cakes Ever. Holiday Inn. I mean, we've got some of the best sponsors to put together an amazing wedding package. So if love is still in the air for you or you know someone that's right in the midst of planning a wedding. I mean, this is wedding season. 
and all that has to happen is the wedding has to be booked sometime before the end of 2015. That's how you are in the contest. So that's how you can actually cash in on your winnings. You have a year and a half to spend it. So take a look at all the details on our website. Get yourself registered. It's going to be a really fun collection of pictures that are happening on Instagram. You might want to check that out as well. Um, and it's just a, it's a really neat deal. We've got some awesome places. Little Chapel I mentioned, uh, Milestone, um, Wildwood Inn. We've got just several places, and I mean, like I said, more than 10, where you can plan the wedding of your dreams. And that's the coolest thing. I don't know many girls who have not spent some time through their growing up years dreaming of themselves as the princess at that perfect wedding. And most girls have a dream. And oftentimes, once the fiancé gets involved, the couple has a dream of that perfect, unique wedding that's just for them, that expresses them and expresses their love. That's what's so cool about Denton. It falls right into the everything else about us that's original and independent. When it comes to weddings, you can have your dream at whatever budget you're looking for. So that's engaged in Denton. But I also wanted to... Um, come back to the horse country which was our last show that we did the horse country tours and just remind you that the first tour for 2014 is coming up this next saturday march the first and there are still some seats available on this tour if you want in so be sure to give us a call at 940-382-7895 or again you can register on our website at horsecountrytours.com and Get in there. There's several, there will be five more tours that we're producing where you can buy tickets to get on a tour um, in 2014. But this is the first one. And believe me when I tell you spring is the time to go. All those sweet little baby horses are out there. In fact, I've been watching several of the ranches post it as newborn babies are, are coming into their folds. So a good thing. You don't want to miss that. If you've never been on a horse country tour, you're going to be amazed at what's out there. And then finally, I want to wrap up today with the fact that spring break is on the way. And, um, hey, if you aren't headed out of town or you're frustrated because you really can't afford to be going off and gallivanting around out of town, you need to remember that Denton's got stuff going on all the time, including spring break. So just because everybody flies the coop doesn't mean Denton grows boring. Stick around spring break. And enjoy Denton like you always do. Dentoning is always in style, even during spring break. You know, we're very proud of our DentonRadio.com artists. And I just want to say again that we do everything we can to promote our local musicians while we're talking about the, radio, the, the music scene here in Denton through DentonRadio.com. And coming up the end of March, we've got a pretty exciting gig going on in Austin. This is the Texas Travel Industry Association's Unity Dinner. It's the largest gathering of travel professionals in the state of Texas. And it goes on in the Austin Convention Center just a few blocks from the Capitol. And we, Denton, sponsor the music with the help of DentonRadio.com. Jake comes in and helps us select the right artists, to play this kind of gig, and we have Caleb Coonrod and Ellie Meyer, very excited about both of them, going to Austin with us this year with Jake. We're all going to be down there promoting Denton's music scene from the heart of Austin, who claims they're the only music scene going on. But, you know, it's like we always say, Austin wishes they were what we've got going on. You know, people say, oh, Denton is everything Austin used to be. No. No, Denton is everything Austin still wishes it was. Good old Pat York came up with that, and I couldn't have said it better myself. So we'll be heading to Austin to make our claim again for what we are in the music scene. So see you out there. See you out and about. Upcoming Denton Radio events. Otherwise, I'll see you next week right here on the show. Thanks for listening. <laughs> <laughs>
There you have it. That was this week's episode of Discover Denton. A big thanks to Kim Phillips of the CVB. And another big thanks to Gravity Feed for providing the intro and outro music. I'm Jake Laughlin, your producer. Join us next week where we will be bringing you more highlights of our original and independent city. And in the meantime, go enjoy Denton.